Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ankush and in this video we will have a discussion about why these archive logs are getting generated. There are many reasons which are behind for the generation of archive logs. First thing is what are the things that is going to be stored into the archive logs. We have a redo logs and then the copy of the redo logs we call it as an archive log. Whenever we are doing the changes to the Oracle database, all those changes are getting tracked to the radio logs. Now what kind of changes I am talking about? The first thing is insertion of data. Whenever you are inserting a lot of data, huge amount of data, in that case, the huge amount of radio logs get generated. And when that radio logs getting filled, it is again transferring from radio logs to the archive logs. This is the structure of Oracle database. Next thing is update. If you if you are doing a huge amount of update on your Oracle database, that is also trying to create that will also generate a huge amount of redo logs. And the next thing is deletes. Now, when you are firing the delete command, that is also changing your indexes. All those changes are getting recorded to the redo logs, and from redo logs. It is passing to the archive logs because your redo logs also get filled. So we have an insert command, we have an update command and the third thing is we have a delete command. Because of that only archive logs are getting changed. Now when I am saying about the insert, there are other operation as well. I am talking about the data pump import. Whenever, well, there are, while we are working as a Oracle DBA, we are getting the request from the client to do schema import. When I'm saying that we need to do the schema import definitely, we need to go with the data pump import. And import command with the data pump internally it is firing the insert command only. So when your data pump operation is going on def definitely that will also generate a lot of retail logs. So these are the few things which are mainly responsible for the generation of radio logs. If you have any queries, you can comment into the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please do like, subscribe and share this channel.